What's up, family? What's up, family? No music right now. This is breaking news. Breaking news. Nipsey Hussle. Nipsey Hussle has just been found. Well, she's been, she's been shot, killed. Uh, I am at a BFW doing something different. I hope you can hear me. If this is breaking news, I'm not going to be here long. I wanted to come to you tonight, today, because this is just that important. Nipsey Hussle has been shot in front of his clothing line company, Nipsey Hussle. If you do not know who he is, look him up. He's a rapper, okay? An American rapper. He released several mixtapes, several mixtapes. Uh, the Marathon, The Marathon Continues, Crenshaw, and he was a rapper who also rapped with Jay-Z, okay? His latest album, Victory Lap, was nominated for the best rap album of the ninth, of the first Grammy, 2019. But forget the rapping piece. Nipsey Hussle was in the process, and I hope you guys can hear me, because I'm at the BFW right here soon. I want you to hear me. This is, this is just that important. I'm not going to be alone. Nipsey Hussle is dead. Shot in front of his company. Okay? Look up Nipsey Hussle. He's not just a rapper. This brother was empowering his people, buying back the community, 33 years old, okay? And he had decided to make a documentary, to make a documentary on Dr. CB, Dr. Sebi, okay? If you don't know who Dr. Sebi is, I'm gonna give you a little history on Dr. Sebi because Dr. Sebi was the same doctor who treated left eye from TLC in Honduras. Dr. CB, Dr. Sebi the sum is a naturopath, okay, a naturopath. Uh, let me see something. Give you a little, give you a little information, like I said, I'm at the, uh, the VFW. Dr. Sebi, the man who cures AIDS, cancer, diabetes and more let me say this again dr sebi look him up dr s-e-b-i c-b or sebi the man who cures not treats but cures aids cancer diabetes and more Nip nipsey hustle was about to do a documentary on dr cb dr sebi he's dead he was shot six times in front of his clothing line his store. Dr. Sebi, who is he? He died in 2016, okay? August 2016. Dr. Sebi was a pathologist, a biochemist, a herbalist. He came to the US from Honduras and was on a mission to heal humanity, okay? As it happens, he had been curing some of the most, he had been curing, not treating people, curing the most deadly diseases on the planet for 30 years. S-E-B-I, Dr. C-B O S E B I, Dr. C B O no matter how you pronounce it, he was curing diseases, okay? And Nipsey Hussle was about to do a documentary on him. And Nipsey Hussle was 33 years old, a youngin', okay? Again, Dr. CB was curing deadly diseases for almost 30 years. AIDS, cancer, diabetes, lupus, epilepsy, or just a few, okay? He was able to completely reverse these, these diseases. He is committed, he was committed to his work and an attorney in New York Sue, well, the FDA sued Dr. CB for his claims. I'll say this again. The FDA, the Food and Drug Administration, sued Dr. CB for his claims of curing AIDS, cancer, sickle cell, lupus, blindness. Okay? Watch this. Just look him up. The judge presiding over the case requested 
that Dr. Sebi or Sebi provide one witness for each disease, for each disease he claimed to have cured. Dr. Sebi or Sebi provided 70 witnesses to support his argument, showing without a doubt that he did in truth heal all these diseases. The judge declared the doctor not guilty on all counts. The judge, Supreme Court in D.C., in, in New York, declared, declared that Dr. C.B. was not guilty in all counts. He had folks come to the court, showed that they was cured from AIDS, okay, lupus, sickle cell, herpes. He was producing, he was promoting an alkaline diet, an alkaline diet, okay? So, with that said, hey honey, I'm not going to laugh. Look at it, honey, honey, look at me. In the Center for Disease Control? Yes, I am. I am talking about the CDC, the Center of Disease, which is a mafia. I'm going to lie. Shit, I have lupus. You said lupus. Did you, you did say lupus. Yes, lupus, an alkaline diet. Go alkaline, you can cure it all. It's all mucus. Dr. Sebi, S-E-B-I, he said if you get on an alkaline diet, you will be cured. And he went to the Supreme Court in New York, and he won the case. But they I killed him. Proper eater as much as any human. Yes, yes. I'm, I'm talking. Ask you more about that. But you, you only hey, hey, honey, take my car. Just give me a call. Give me a call. Again, I'm live. I'm at the BMW suit. Talking. Well, hey, but you just shoot yes, I just shoot, shoot too. Yes, no, 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 no. Don't shoot yourself. I'm a firearm oh, instructor. Honey, give me a call. No, no, no. Just before shoot. you shoot yourself, don't call. Don't, don't call me before you shoot yourself. So look, with that said. The doctors, the, the court cleared Dr. Sebi and, and because he said that the root of all these illnesses, diseases, is mucus. Okay? Mucus, mucus, mucus. So, uh, he brought 70 witnesses to support his argument, showing without a doubt that he had cured them. And he won the case. He won the case. So why is Nipsey Hussle important? Because he was about to do a documentary on Dr. CB. And he's dead. Dead, okay? He's dead. Family, there are no coincidences. No coincidence. And that's why I'm coming to you right now. Short, sweet, to the point. Nipsey Hussle is talking about buying back the community. Okay. He was going to do a documentary on Dr. Sebi. He's dead. Fam, listen. What I do and what many of us do who take the chances to promote black thought, black voices, black issues, black concerns. It comes with a price. And we're not just out here just talking because we can't talk. We've lost a whole lot. Nipsey Hussle is dead. He was a rapper who was nominated for a Grammy this year for his victory lap CD. He's dead. I don't know all the particulars. I saw his interview about him talking about Dr. C.B., Dr. Sebi, because he knew how important Dr. Sebi's work was, because when Dr. Sebi, when they killed him two years ago, and then three days later, they came out, Western media came out, that they found a cure for AIDS. Dr. Sebi had been curing AIDS, HIV, epilepsy, for the last 30 years. He knew nothing about that. 
we need to be serious about the survival of our people. This is important to me. I was going to talk about something different, and I'm at another location, and I may have to come back and do a follow-up with this. Please share this. Please share this. Nipsey Hussle was not just a rapper. He was evolving. A lot of rappers are evolving right now. They had the money. The way the system is set up, you get the money to the entertainers, the rappers, the, the sports figures, who may not be conscious, but they have, they, they're, they're symbols of success. So the media would get behind him. But when they become conscious, like Nipsey Hussle became conscious, again, I don't know all the particulars, but he's dead. But I knew what he was about to do. He was about to do a documentary on Dr. Sebi. I need you to look up Dr. Sebi for yourselves and see this man went to the Supreme Court in New York. FDA charged him, accused him of being false, of being fraudulent. And he bought 70 witnesses that he cured of epilepsy. HIV, lupus, all the cancers. And his main thing was this. His main, not thing, his main perspective, he was able to identify mucus is to, is, is the cause for all this. All your diseases come from mucus, family. Mucus. Your, your sinuses, mucus. Your lungs, mucus. Your prostate, it's all mucus. If you get rid of the mucus, you kill, you starve the disease. An alkaline diet. Again, please, 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 share this video. Share this video. I may have to come back tonight uh, and talk more about this. Uh, it says, moreover, mucus in the retina of the eye will cause blindness. Mucus, mucus in the retina of the eye will cause blindness. If it is found around the thyroid gland, it's called the cancer of the thyroid. This, this is what Dr. Sebi said. Basically, basically, disease will arise in the body wherever there's an accumulation of toxins, okay? It says, according to Dr. Sebi, blood and starch in the diet are the main reasons we can be overrun with clogging plaque he believes starch is a chemical that wrecks havoc on the health, mainly because it causes acid, acidity within the body. The same with animal products on the whole. An acid body will create toxic mucus and will congest you. Let me say this. When we was brought to America from Africa. Number one, they didn't bring our diet. Soul food is not our diet. We've been on starch and blood since we've been here. Rice, meats. I'm not a vegetarian, but I'm letting you know that I do stuff in moderation. But they did not give us our diet when we got here. We've been on starches and blood since we've been here. And starch and blood is acid. If you eliminate the acid, you will eliminate the disease. So if you're wrestling with diabetes right now, congestion, lupus, epilepsy, AIDS, HIV, if you get on an alkaline diet, alkaline, just look it up. You will reverse the process. Reverse the process. And again, Nipsey Hussle was in the process of making a documentary about Dr. Seba. Or oh, Dr. Seba. And he's gone. This is breaking news. Breaking news. So look. I had to go live with this because it's just that important. Those who are trying to enlighten, empower, educate, and promote 
group economics, they've been targeted for destruction. Okay? I plead, I beg you to please, 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 please look up Nipsey Hussle, Dr. CB, and the alkaline diet, and you see for yourself. I hope you can hear me. I got music in the background. I was talking to folks that was here. I, but I, again, this is no small matter to me. No small matter. Um, a rapper who was evolving is gone. Peace be upon him and his family. But I challenge you to change your diet. I'm not telling you go vegan or nothing. I'm telling you, if you want to heal yourself, the first, the first law of man is to heal yourself. Heal yourself. I'll say this. Even, even the scriptures say this. Save yourself first. Even in an airplane. If the airplane's going down, they tell you this. When that little oxygen mask fat come down, it don't tell you to get put on somebody else. You save yourself first. So I'm going to bring this to, a, to an end. I may come back from something else or a continuation. But Nipsey Hussle, I don't know him personally. He's an L.A. rapper. But I knew he was trying to empower and buy back the community. I knew that he was about to do a documentary on Dr. Sebi. Dr. Sebi won a case in the New York Supreme Court. He was accused by the FDA of promoting cures or healing people. And all he had to produce was one person, and he produced 70 people with AIDS, herpes, lupus, diabetes. And he won. So look, with that said, I'm going to get up out of here. I want you guys to uh, look it up, Dr. Sebi, Nipsey Hussle, and take back your health, and take back your health. At the end of the day, that's all we got is our health. Your health is your greatest wealth, period. An alkaline diet, every morning and every night, I have lemon water in the morning, and lemon water at night. On top of me walking the earth, earthly, which barefooted, put my hands in the soil and go into the range and shoot. Okay, I'm just trying to help you. You want to, uh, uh, let me see this. If you want to contact me, go to juanjohn29 at gmail.com. That's juanjohn29 at gmail.com. I've been talking about we need our own media, our own black thought, black voices, a black prefer, a black perspective. We have that. Real talk that I do is incorporated. It's an LLC. When you guys see me come on here, it is not just my thoughts. I am an LLC. I pay taxes on this every year for what I do. This is not just me just, you know, spouting out. I'm serious about this. So if you want to support Juanjohn29 at gmail.com. But please do not sleep on this story. Information is still evolving about Nipsey Hussle. I don't know all the particulars, but I know this. The brother was trying to do good. He's gone. He's gone. He's dead. Okay? With that said, I'm going to get about it. Here. Thank you, thank you, thank you for tuning in. I appreciate it. Uh, I just appreciate it because you could be doing something else, but I thank you. Nipsey Hussle, Dr. CB, gone. And if you know about if and if you don't know about Dr. Sebi, S E B I, but look him up, and you will see for yourself. This is not no coincidence. Just like the six uh, uh, protesters from Ferguson. We've lost between five and six protesters of the Michael Brown shoot in Ferguson. They're dead. There are no coincidences, family. No coincidences. When you out here trying to tell the truth, trying to enlighten, empower, 
educate us, there's a price you pay for that. Like I said, I found something worth living for. I died no time soon. No time soon. But you, 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 get serious about your lives. Get serious about your health. Get serious about us as a people. Like I said, I may come back and deal with what we need to do. What we what we need to do right now. Because I don't want to want to take away from, from this MC Hustle, Dr. CB piece, Dr. Sammy piece. But look, at the end of the day, it is not how much you know, it's how much you care. It's bigger than any one of us. It's bigger than any one of us, okay? But that's it. I'm out. I thank you. I thank you. I thank you. Godspeed. Uh, blessings be upon you. I believe in you. I want nothing but the best for you. And just know this, you are not alone. You are not alone in this fight to be right. Do your own thing. And if you look at if you need to text me and talk, I'm there for you. Juan John29 at gmail.com is not just for range and shooting. You have somebody in your life who's really concerned about you, about your welfare, and really want your best. Take advantage of it. You cannot go to the grave saying, I didn't have nobody who had my best interest, who I could talk to. You can't, you can't say that no more. I am here to help guide you to the next level, or be that, that maybe that last voice that you talked to. So again, please, Dr. CB, Dr. Sebi, okay, and Nipsey Hussle, look them up. This is not a coincidence, okay? We're being plucked off. Those who have love for us are being killed. Keeping it real. With that said, I'm gonna see if I come back later, later on tonight, do something else. But it's not how much you know, it's how much you can. I'm out. Thank you, thank you, thank you. God bless you. God bless you, God bless you. Heaven's about to you. And I'll talk to you soon. Thank you all for tuning in. Peace be, peace be upon Nipsey Hustle and Dr. CB.